I am Anil Kumar and here is solution of question number 1 page 151 from Nelson on optimization marginal cost. Now some of my students are having difficulty in understanding the basic terms. I will take this opportunity to explain the terms and then provide you with the solution. The question here is the cost in dollars to produce x liters of maple syrup is C of x equals to 75 times square root of x minus 10 where x is greater than or equal to 400. What is average cost of producing 625 liters? Part B is what is marginal cost at 1225 liters and then we have how much production is needed to achieve a marginal cost of 50 cents per liter. Now the first term here is what is average cost of producing 625 liters? We are given the cost of production. Average cost is cost of products production divided by the quantity produced, right? So it is Cx over x. That is how average cost is defined. Now, cost of production is given to us. Let us substitute that, which is 75 times square root of x x is 625 so substitute that value of x 625 liters minus 10 divided by x which is 625 right so that will give you the average cost the formula of course will be you can write the formula here first which is 75 times square root of x minus 10 divided by x correct so that is how the formula is now, once you substitute, you can use calculator to find this answer, right? So, let's figure it out. So, we have 75 and within brackets, we have square root of 625 minus 10, bracket close. We can say equal to and then divide by 625 to get the answer. In decimals, it is equal to uh, 1.80 right so we can write 1.80 as the average cost and all these costs are in dollars we'll write dollars here so that is how you find average cost so remember average cost is cost of production divided by the items produced right that is how you should relate part b is what is marginal cost at 1225 now marginal cost is rate of change of cost when the production level is 1225. So marginal cost basically is C prime of X, right? So derivative of the cost. So this derivative of the cost will be what you can find is you can find derivative of this particular function. That is to say it is 75 times uh, square root of x which is 1 over 2 square root x right so that becomes the derivative of this function you could write this function as open the bracket it becomes 75 square root x minus 750 right now use this function to find derivative so derivative of square root x is half of square root x in the denominator you need to find marginal cost that is marginal cost so the derivative c prime of x is marginal cost. Now substitute 1225 for x. So we have 75 times 1 over 2 square root of 1225. Query. Use calculator to find the answer. So we have 75 divided by 2 equals to divided by square root of 1225 equals to 15 over 14 which is uh, dollar 1.07 approximately right so that is the marginal cost at 1225 liters right the third question is how much production is needed to achieve a marginal cost of 50 cents per liter so we are given the marginal cost correct so we'll again use the same formula which for us is marginal cost is actually equals to 75 divided by to square root of x. Now in this case we are given the marginal cost that means we are given 
c prime of x and we need to find x so we can write the formula as square root of x as equals to 75 divided by 2 times c prime of x right now since it is given as 50 cents we'll substitute 50 cents here and find x right so x will be square of all this so we can write here x is the production level will be square of 75 over 2 marginal cost right whole square so that is what it is in our case that is 50 so we'll write 75 divided by 2 times 0 0.5 and whole square right so we can use calculator to find this answer so it is 75 divided by 2 times 0.5 is 1 right so anyway let's do within brackets 2 times 0.5 equal to and then we'll square this equals to so we get our answer 5625 so get 5625 as the answer so that is the production right so so many liters is to be produced to get a marginal cost of 50 cents per liter right so that is how these parameters are related I hope that is clear to you. Thank you and all the best.